the WS-15 afterburning turbofan engine under development for the Chinese People's Liberation Army Air Force's top air superiority fighter the Chengdu J-20 has reportedly entered serial production, according to a statement by an Aero Engine Corporation of China official. The long-awaited engine is thought to currently be in low-rate initial production. WS-15 is a clean-sheet new design which is expected to remain in production in enhanced forms past past the year 2050. Development makes China the first country to serially produce an engine with such high specifications after the United States, which developed the F-119 engine for its equivalent fighter to the J-20 the F-22 Raptor, and subsequently an enhanced derivative the F-135 for its lighter single-engine F-35 fighter. The WS-15 is expected to not only have a much longer life and lower maintenance requirements than the WS-10, but also a massively greater power output which will give the J-20 more thrust than any other tactical combat aircraft in the world. The engine is also expected to introduce two- or three-dimensional thrust vectoring capabilities for improved maneuverability. Introduction of the WS-15 is expected not only to make the J-20 far more maneuverable, but also provide much more energy for onboard sensors and other avionics and potentially provide a more viable option for powering future directed energy weapons such as laser weapons. While the J-20 already has a much longer range than any Western fighter, the WS-15 is expected to extend this significantly further still due to its greater fuel efficiency. It will allow the fighter to fly at much higher supersonic speeds without using afterburners. A new variant of the J-20 which is speculated to be the new airframe type first seen in December 2022 with improved stealth features, is thought to have been modified to make better use of the new power plant and may be designated the J-20B, where the baseline J-20 used stopgap Russian engines and the improved J-20A was produced from 2019 with the WS-10C. 10 Although the J-20 entered full-scale production in late 2021, and has been entering service very quickly since at far greater rates than the F-22 ever did, the WS-15's potential lowering of the fighter's lifetime costs and expanding of its advantages, 